Welcome to the boxing book. Oscar got all messed up. There you go. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, sorry about that, y'all. All right, we are back. We are back. It is good to be back. Uh, we're going to get into uh, Sandy Ryan and uh, Terry Harper. Uh, this is a fight that I'm not particularly intrigued by, uh, but I got a lot of requests for it, so we're going to get into it. We're going to break it down. But before we do, please like, share, and subscribe. Follow the Boxing Bookie, all forms of social media, 3D Boxing, 3D Boxing Blog. Also, subscribe. Uh, to the Patreon, the link is in the description. Uh, the Patreon is five dollars a month that gets you the lock of the week, uh, which will be coming out Thursday. You'll get the lock of the week for this week. Uh, additionally, uh, you get the free T-shirt. You can ask the bookie anything. Handicap a fight. Uh, ask me to handicap any fight. And I will do it for you. Um, so you get all that and a lot more for just five dollars a month. Helps goes a long way. Helps me do this full time. Um, the boxing book, uh, but, but, but I am sorry. Uh, again, the boxing bookie doesn't gale, but if you do, I always use DraftKings. Uh, DraftKings gives a good book, it's good, good fair odds, and uh, it's it's friendly to use. So we always use DraftKings. You can't even use DraftKings in Texas, uh, but if you guys gamble, DraftKings it is. Um, all right, also subscribe to the other Texas boxing scene on YouTube. All right, let's get into this fight. This will be a fairly quick video. Uh, Sandy Ryan, she's an ox. She's physically strong. She's big. She's quite a handsome woman. Uh, she's tall, strong, long. M maintains control of the ring using her, her jab. Really good jab. That's her best punch, but she sets up the right hand. She's basically in that. She's a basic jab cross fighter. Uh, she needs to fight on the outside. That's where she's comfortable using that height and reach. There's no head movement. She does get hit, and this could be a problem, but she's shown a pretty good chin so far. Uh, she wants to march forward. She's flat-footed, comes forward, um, and uses the jab, right hand, keep you off. Uh, she's good at what she does. She's really good at what she does. She's got a nice lead left hook, too. She, she throws the left hook nicely. She's slow. You know, she is what he is. She's a slow, plotting fighter, but her jab is good. Her right hand is good. She's physically strong. She's a beast of a woman. The concern is the lack of movement. I, I don't think this is going to come in too much trouble in this fight. And when we get into Terry, Terry Harper, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about why. But she's powerful. She's strong. She rips shots to the body. Nice left hook to the body. She's a good body puncher. She's just easy to hit. And that's, that's her one downfall. Downfall is she's easy to hit. She's got good timing on her straight right hand. She's, the right hand is good. The jab is good. Jab, right hand, strong. She can keep you off of her. She can maintain range. She's good at that. The downfall is she's slow and she's easy to hit. Terry Harper. She's also slow, but not as slow as Sandy Ryan. She's defensively sloppy. You see that she drops her hand. She's easy to, she's easy to hit when she's throwing. When she's throwing, she gets sloppy. So you can counter her. She's got pretty good foot movement, speed. She, uh, not speed. She's, she's got good footwork. She, she moves pretty well. Her hands are a little slow. Her feet aren't the quickest, but she's got solid footwork. She's not a puncher. She's susceptible to getting hit by the right hand. So off the bat, you know, she can't hit. So she can't stop uh, Sandy Ryan from walking her down. And she gets hit by the right hand. She's defensively flawed. She's gonna, you see what I'm getting at here. She's not a, a big volume puncher either. So she's going to lose the battle of the jab. She's going to get hit with the right hand. And she's, can't, she's not going to win rounds on, on volume. You see what I'm saying? I don't think Terry Harper is a very good fighter. I thought she lost the Brockes fight. Uh... I, I, don't, I, I don't think Harper is very good. She's, I, she moves... Okay, like her footwork, her movement is okay. That's really, that's really her strength. I can't see her getting on the inside, and she's gonna lose the fight on the on the outside. She eats a lot of straight rights. She, she can throw it in nice combinations. She just doesn't let her hands go. I don't really see Terry Harper having much of a path to victory here. I see her basically losing the fight to the jab and the right hand. 
of Sandy Ryan, and that's basically how the fight's going to go. So let's take a look at the odds. I, I, I like this fight to bet on. I think there's uh, good money to be made on this fight. What I like are, are these two bets. So your one times bet, in this case, $100 on Sandy Ryan by decision or technical decision. It's going to a hundred dollar bet there at minus 165 is going to make you about sixty dollars and sixty cents. Not terrible for I, I think a fairly safe bet. Over eight and a half minus 575, one hundred dollars. So it going over eight and a half, which I would bet the ranch on, is going to make you seventeen dollars. So the two and thirty nine cents. So the two bets together are going to make you what is that? Sixty and seventeen and seventy seven. And won $78. So a $2 bet is going to make you $78. I feel this is really, really safe. You got um, you got a safe bet here. You know, I, I don't really see a path to victory for, for, for Harper. Sandy Ryan is going to win this fight on the outside with a jab in the right hand. It's going to go the distance. This is what I like. Over 8.5, Sandy Ryan. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, leave your thoughts, comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Follow the Boxing Bookie on all forms of social media. Uh, the Boxing Bookie comes in for every single major fight. Join the Patreon. Link is in the description. Just $5 a month gets you the lock of the week. It gets you a free T-shirt. You can ask the bookie anything. Ask me to handicap any fight. I'll break it down for you. I'll show you how to make money on it. Get you all that and a heck of a lot more for just $5 a month. Uh also, subscribe to the other channel, Texas Boxing Scene on YouTube. That's Texas Boxing Scene. All proceeds go to Autism Research and Recovery. It is, what day is it? It's March 19th, 2024. From Texas to the world, thank you and God bless. Don't miss a tweet, post, story, or video. 3D Boxing is on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Hit the subscribe button now to stay inside the ring.